some sort of YouTube thing. Do they send us something uh, now? It's a hundred thousand if you uh, want. You get, I think you get a cushion in the shape of a play button. Twelve Vestal Virgins. To, what? All fifty thousand of you. What the f***? I what are know. you doing with your lives? I don't know. There's nothing. Just go. Like, I go, hope you're watching this in the pub. Go to the pub. At the very least. Yeah. Or go to put go, this down. Go, go, go to, to the, the pub. pub. No, don't put it down. Uh, because we've got we've got a, a flashback episode coming up. Oh coming right now and everyone loves a flashback nobody loves a flashback been so many Johnny. The birth of my child. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. By that I mean the Which birth one? Of, of the Craft Beer Channel. The birth of the Craft Beer Channel. The old, a, old fountain in 2013. Oh, wow. Yeah. That, those were days. Yeah. Sausage and mash and a beer. I always went for the halloumi salad. We've had some great times. Yeah. We've had some times I can't remember which I'm sure mm. were absolutely amazing. They were great for someone I'm sure. Um, um, I love what have I loved? I've loved going to Norway yeah. twice. We've done so. We've done about two hundred and seventy videos, a little bit more. Wow! Uh, and about eight of them mm. are from Norway. Yes, more than that, probably ten of them. So mm. one in every twenty-seven videos is from Norway. I'm sorry if that was a bit boring for you guys, That's but a we good loved it. Batting average of Norway. Yeah. For me, as close as I got to church mm. in the past four years has been drinking half-price Pliny at the tap room in in Santa Rosa. How good is um, that? And eating pizza, chicken pizza. wings, and we got an amazing yeah. tour. And going to Bear Republic as well was awesome because we was awesome. like we loved Racer Five, but we yeah. didn't expect to be blown away like we were by what they were doing there. Mm. Uh, what about you? Where where, where else have you? Lived? Uh, I mean that that trip uh, to Pilsner and then going out into the Bavarian forest. Yeah. To the blown up brewery. Yeah, the, bullet holes the, in the walls. Alsatians trying that to was, bite that you. That was you with that amazing charismatic man. Yeah, he stood next to his portrait there. in the same pose the as his portrait. Yeah, his his like his beer was the best lager I've ever tasted. Dude, what else has been amazing? Uh, brewing, brewing at Gypsy Hill. Yeah, love those Bre guys. Brewing Drifter, which we think was the second New England IPA in the country. In the country, ahead of the curb. Yeah, Johnny. Well, it's ahead of the curb. Yeah, curb. curb. <laughs> oh, that was my South London accent. <laughs> Um, that was pretty amazing. I'd love to know if we were the second, because that's quite a claim. I think Cloudwater just pipped us at the post. I, I guess, I mean, this seems a bit self congratulatory so we should we should say thank you so much for all the people that supported us along the way. Mm -hmm. So, obviously you guys uh, for watching and still watching. Uh, but also, you know, when we were at the start, we knew nothing. Yeah. We knew nothing. And so we quickly made friends with people like Chris Hall, Matt Curtis. I read books by Melissa Cole, Pete Brown, Randy Mosher. All those guys have... They have quite literally uh, informed what I know about beer. Mm -hmm. And the guy that informed what I know about filmmaking is Keith Floyd. 
who also probably can't remember most of what he filmed. Well, he's, he's dead. And so he's also dead. So, he's dead, yeah. right? So he don't remember nothing yeah. now. But here, here's the Keith. I'll drink to Keith. Yeah. So we're going to keep it fun. Uh huh. That's the way that we want to do it, and I think the way that you guys want to do it. But we do need your opinion on where this channel is going to go. So we've had an incredible year, just 2017. Uh, we have two books. Two? Not one, but two. This one comes out uh, in just under a month's time. Uh, it's not just a guidebook for London. It is a I'd exploration say... of the scene with interviews with like Evan, with mm. the guys from Brew by Numbers, with Jasper from Camden Town. And you'll, we learned so much writing it, so hopefully we've managed to pack that information in. Exactly. So that's a big plan for us coming up. But also, we want to do some extra stuff. So the first thing we want to do is launch a shop. We want to put not only the beers that we discover, but also we want to put, put some merch out there. So we'd love to know what kind of merch you'd be looking for. Would it be a t-shirt with one of Brad's slogans like Pete Bog Mummies or The Darkness Is Upon Us or other other such ones? <laughs> or would you want bottle openers? Do you want better glassware? I think I want a bigger glass. I always want the bigger glass, yeah. but I'm greedy. So. And you've got we've got a cooler logo now that you've made. Yeah. Think, so we can put that on. So we'll do more glassware. Yeah. Plaid shirts to match your beard, this, maybe? This guy. I just want a plaid shirt with CBC on I'm gonna it. Buy, that's what I'm going to buy you for Christmas. <laughs> your birthday this year. I'm getting you plaid a shirt lumberjack. Yeah, there you so go. we can be lumberjacks together yeah. in dreams. Um, <laughs> okay. Uh, we'd also love to know, would you uh, give us free money? Well, so, <laughs> I've always been sceptical about quite, Patreon. That's quite blunt. Patreon, yeah. though. Patreon. Because because I feel like you would be giving us beer money. Because we do spend a lot of what we earn, and what we earn is not a lot, on beer. But also flights and obviously on equipment. So yeah. hopefully our sound issues have been sorted. Yeah. Our visual issues have been sorted now. I mean, my, you know, what I would love to achieve this year is just to make more amazing, engaging content. We'd, we'd love to know whether, whether Patreon would be something you guys would want to be involved with, mm -hmm. um, what you might want in return. Um, because it does cost us a lot of money. We we make a little bit, but what we make, we spend, basically. Yeah, we've like invested everything back into yeah. the kit, yeah. into the booze. The lens on this camera that Brad made oh, me buy cost a grand. Oh, look at it! One thousand pounds. It's so long; it's nearly in my face. It is nearly in your face. Um, so we'd love a bit of money to invest in, particularly to make the sound better, because breweries are noisy fucking places. They are. So the stuff that is definitely going to happen is more travel. Mm -hmm. So a, we'd love to know where you think we should go, or where you'd like to see us go to learn about stuff. Top of my list is Bamberg. Yeah, I want to go drink me some Schlenkerle oh, yeah. uh, in the brew pub. What about you? Uh, well, I'm always. I always want to go back to America yeah. because America's amazing, obviously. Um, I, I'd, I'd love to go to Copenhagen. I've never been to Copenhagen. Um, okay, well, maybe we'll go to CBC. We'll go to McCullough's. Yeah, uh, part that'd, be cool. that'd be cool. That'd be cool. Um, yeah, let us know where you want to go. Let us know what you think of Patreon and let us know what you would want from the shop. And we will make this channel not only the biggest, because it's almost the biggest, we'll make it the best beer YouTube channel in the world. And we'll get that fucking fluffy play cushion. Love you, brothers. Love you, mate.